what we're doing today is we're going to be uh, changing the uh, blades on this 2007 Husky LT4200. I sort of ran into a tree stump and dented the deck and of course along with that goes the blades. So we're going to remove the deck, remove the deck uh, as uh, your instructions would go, but uh, and then we will change the blades while we're at it. I've been meaning to change the blades and I'm pretty darn sure they're bent too. So what I'm going to do is remove the deck and then we'll get back to the changing of the blades. Okay, now well, there's the other side, there's the first blade that we're going to remove, and these are the blades that I'm going to be putting on there. As you can see, there's a part number 198059 by the Oregon uh, Company. Okay, there you go. And I'll, I'll put uh, more information in the, descript in the description if needed. Okay, so this is the blade that I need on this Husky, this 2007 Husky. LT4200. You see the star in it? Okay, that's the star center. And there are other blades that have different than the star, but uh, make sure it fits on yours before then, okay? One of the things you got, the first thing that you got to do is to block the blade so that you can turn the nut and, uh, you know, and keep the, hold the blade in place there. So I'm going to use that screwdriver. And I'm going to use a crescent wrench. These things can be a bugger, but if you're lucky, they'll come off. I, I have replaced these nuts before. All right. Okay, this one's coming off rather easy. Probably got loosened when I smashed it. Right. There you go. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Here's the star hole again. And a lot of blades will say what top or bottom is somewhat, but these blades don't, but I see. I see the part number over there, so I know that's that's facing out. Okay. Sure, it's in there, right? In this case, righty tighty, lefty loosey. I have seen some of the mowers that the, the, the thread patterns the opposite. So, I'm gonna get that back over there. Okay. I'm gonna get it, gonna get it, gonna get it pretty darn tight. your knuckles. Nice. 
making sure it spins freely. And I still got the belt on there, so there's a little drag on it, but I'm making sure it's not hitting the back. Same thing for the opposite side. There's other ways to do it. You could do it with a piece of wood or some other way to block the blade from spinning. But like I said, it's just my way. Do it or don't, do it at your own risk. Ah, this one's nice and tight. Goes. Who persuades you? Look, she's off. Oh, yeah. Righty tighty. Nice and tight. New blades. You might have seen, I was making sure they weren't touching in the middle. They're not. But they're close. 